One of the things I like about using uh, Hunt Data's digital maps in the backcountry or on this ranch that we're using it is I'm dropping a pin every time we're either catching a bugle or, or seeing a herd or six by six bull, whatever that is. And I begin to gather information and build a profile. And so I'm starting to see what some of their traditions are, their, their tendencies are. Um, we did say it's a little bit different here on this private ranch than it would be in the National Forest, but it begins to help me to, again, to look at the big picture and back out of the map and see where I'm seeing a section of the, of the ranch where they're more uh, congregated, more concentrated. And so that helps me begin to build a profile about the, about the elk here on this ranch. I'm Lisa Thompson. I'm Danelle Johnson. And we're here to show you the new custom field map that Hut Data has come out with. One of the things we like is that you can actually choose either a topo, a satellite, or your favorite species, whether that be elk, deer, antelope, bear, lion, whatever that concentration is, we can put that information over the map. We've been making products for over 26 years, but hands down, this is the most rugged material we've ever had. It's waterproof, water resistant, tear proof. You can put it in your backpack, it can be raining, but more importantly, it's gonna show you how to get in and out of your hunting area, how to maneuver, how to strategize. These particular maps right here are six mile by six mile, seven and a half minute map, but you can go up to 12 mile by 12 mile in a seven and a half minute map. And then we have the traditional 36 inches by 40 inches that's one to 100,000. All of our maps have a legend on them right here that are sold in the stores. And at the bottom they have a QR code. And that's where you can add with your, um, we use Avenza Maps. And you can QR code this right here on Avenza Maps and download this BLM map of unit 18 if this is what you want. And so th these have been really, really helpful for me to be able to go into where those elk are uh, most heavily concentrated and, and, and look and compare that to public land so I know that I'm not trespassing. And, and, and I look for uh, areas where maybe it's surrounded by some private land but there's access to some public areas. So even right here on this McDonald Ranch, there's still a piece right up here, the Spanish Peaks uh, wildlife area that is actually public land. You can get it in a six by six or 12 by 12. Did you say a six by six bowl? I want to shoot a 12 by 12 bowl. What is that? I don't know, it's huge. It's big.